In this video, I'll show you how to convert a WebM video file to MP4 for free using Handbrake. Hi, my name is David, and if this is your first time watching my videos and you get value from the content that you watch, kindly consider liking this video and sharing it with your friends so that we can all learn together. So, let's assume you have a WebM video file. And first of all, what is a WebM video file? A WebM video file is a compressed video file format uh, that is supported for the web and it is one of uh, the few standards of video uh, that supports HTML5 videos very, very well uh, because it is based on the Matroska container that's also available in things like MKV videos. And uh, basically what uh, this helps is that it helps in uh, rendering good video quality that is small size or that is compressed. So if you've received a WebM video file from somebody probably you want to convert it to mp4 so that you can make make any edits that you want uh, let's say on a video editing application then you can use handbrake to convert the webm video file from webm to mp4 so here's our webm video file and if i just hover over it uh, here we go item type webm video file and uh, one of the players that can play this video file is vlc if i just double click on it with the recent case, update on the YouTube video file, but let's say we just want to convert it. So just come up uh, to here. Let's say uh, Handbrake. And if you don't have Handbrake installed, it's going to be available. A link is going to be available below. It's available for Mac, Windows and Linux. So everybody's covered. And then let's just drag and drop our video uh, right into uh, Handbrake. There we go. So we want the format to be MP4 and Handbrake supports uh, different formats uh, to be uh, converted. We have MP4, MKV, WebM. So we want an MP4 and you already see uh, the output is going to be a dot MP4. So you can check on the dimensions. That is if the source matches the width that is set up here. And then we can check the filters, the video, the video, let's assume uh it's in 30 frames per second 30 fps so this matches uh, what is available uh you can work based on the quality uh, uh, uh an rf of 22 is good quality it's going to give you good quality uh and a low video and a smaller video size without affecting the quality uh of anything uh, whatsoever so that's something that i can say you can use uh but uh we won't change anything if you wanted to use bit rates, uh, then you can set the bitrate that you want based on what you have here. Uh, and then we have the audio. You can see uh, the type of audio available. And if you had subtitles to add, you can actually import the subtitles and ban the subtitles to the video or to the WebM video using Handbrake. Uh, now, once it's converted, it's going to be MP4. So since all we wanted was to convert and we have checked that the dimensions are okay, uh, the video settings are okay, that is the frame rate, and also the quality that we want, then all we need to do is just click on start and code. Now, please ensure that you set the, the folder where you want your file saved uh, so that uh, you don't have any issue finding your file. So let's just click on start and code. And depending on the length of your video uh, and the type of encoding, for example, if you used uh, let's say we go to video. If you decided to use the average bitrate and go for two pass encoding, it's going to do uh, two passes. It's usually a good way, gives better quality from my experience when you do that. Uh, but since this is for demonstration purposes only, we'll just have the one pass encoding and it's under videos. So we can just navigate to the videos folder. And if you look at the container, it's an MP4. So, so that is how you can easily convert a WebM video file to MP4 for free using Handbrake. I hope this video is going to be of value to somebody that wants to convert a WebM video to MP4. Thanks for watching. My name is David. Until next time, stay safe and never stop learning. Thanks for watching.